Hello there guys, this is Matthew the Dinosaur King and today I am back with another review. And today we will, we will be taking a look at the brand new for 2018 the Safari Limited Dimetrodon. Now Dimetrodon, which name means two types of teeth, is a genus of synapsid that lived during the mid to late Permian period around 295 to 272 million years ago in the United States and Germany. Now, over 12 species of this animal are known, all across America and also one from Germany. And depending on the species, they were anywhere from 1.7 to 4.6 meters long and around 28 to 250 kilograms in weight. And now the smallest species was only about 60 centimeters long and the largest was about 15 feet. So they were probably the apex predators of their environment. And they would have preyed upon many types of prehistoric amphibian, like, Dipl like uh, Diplocolus, other synapsids like Edaphosaurus, and potentially also some of the larger species might have even preyed upon the shark Xenacanthus that also shared its environment. Now, Dimetrodon has had a bit of a makeover in recent years. No longer do we have the smooth sail that we've all grown up with, but as you can see, we now have these spikes which are the spines of the sail jutting out from the top. Now, this has been thanks to the fossil record where we have found numerous um, top parts of the vertebrae in the sail have actually been broken, but also fused. So it seems like the top bits would have stuck out of the skin of the sail. Would have probably been in like various different positions, like maybe some would have been forward, back, sideways, all sorts, because of all the damages they would have sustained in life. Let's take a closer look at this figure. I mean, this is a very, very well done Dimetrodon, one of the best I've seen. And I think Safari Limited has done, have done a great job in doing this. I think this was sculpted by Doug Watson, I'm definitely sure it was. And, it's, and here we have this beautiful head sculpt here, classic Dimetrodon head. And we can see, we see the two types of teeth. We've got the large canines and also the smaller incisors in there. Beautiful scale detailing on here. There's the eye, got the nostril there. The size of the other eyes are not inside of the mouth. Got the tongue sculpted in there, more of the teeth. Really, really nice. And going around the body, we can see more like this musculature. You can see a lot of the muscles there are showing. Whereas here on the side of the body, we've got the front feet here. One of them is raised as if it's walking. Back to see, we've got the five clawed digits all this very nice skin detail I mean, look at those scales that scale detail is gorgeous the back here we've got the five toes five clawed toes we've got the little curl in the tail more of that lovely scale de detail and then again on this side I mean, just look at this beautiful muscle detail here more of these lovely scales Beautifully done. And, up, and then here on the sail, you can see that it is actually a lot different texture to show the skin and also the um, the vertebrae, the spines going all the way up. I think that's a lovely detail on there. Very, very nicely done. The color scheme is also very nice. Sort of like these red stripes on the sail, along with this sort of like mustard yellow, I've heard. Some of my friends call it the um, the potato chip, <laughs> which I think is actually quite cool. Or, uh, or here in the UK we can call it um, McCoy after the McCoy's crest because they've got sort of that sort of um, ribbed texture to them that the crests that we have here are you know, have on them. Um, the main body is like this sort of like slate grey, which I think is actually quite nice with this sort of orangey brown underbelly. And there we've got more of this lovely detail on, on here, this is there, 2018, Dimetrodon. Um, I think here, this is where the cloaca would have been. I can't really see a full one, but it looks like this line here is the cloaca. It's got some nice sculpted detail on there. even got a little throat wattle. I think it's quite cool. I got the tail. Now, with this figure, a lot of people were worried that it was dragging its tail. But as you can see, the tail does not actually drag on the ground. See, if you try to... It doesn't. So it does actually have its tail off of the ground, which we know Dimetrodon would have actually had. And for a little comparison, here is Carnegie's older version. As you can see, 
Dimetrodon has had a bit, a bit of a change. No longer do we have this sail here, but I think they make actually quite a nice pair to show how far our studies of this creature have come, and you know, it's kind of nice to see. Actually, I think the newer Dimetrodon is a, its sail is slightly taller because of those spines coming out of, the, out of its sail. And then here's the little Xenacanthus shark from the safari tube, so you can probably put these two together. But I don't think these are in scale, but it's cool to put them together as they would have been a potential prey item for Dimetrodon. So yeah, so this is the uh, brand new 2018 Safari Limited Dimetrodon. I believe this is Dimetrodon Grandis. I think because of this, um, the size of the, of the skull and everything. So one of the better known species, but not the type species. But yeah, I think this is a fantastic figure that Safari has done. A really nice update. I, I know that people have said that collector's one is slightly more accurate, and I would say it is because of the way that they've done the sale. However, the color scheme on the collector one, I'm not sure if I like. I might probably pick it up to compare it with the Safari one, but the Safari one, I think, is just... It's its a brilliant figure. I highly recommend you pick this up. Great pose, great colours, great accuracy. The feet might be a little bit oversized. Maybe a little bit, but I don't mind. It's perfectly fine with me. I think it's a great figure. So, um, I do hope you like this video, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. Um, my next review um, will probably be on the Safari Limited 2018 Regal Ceratops. So, please look out for that in the coming days. And I hope to see you then. So please take care and have a great day. Bye.